I don't even know how I look right now, honestly. I don't have a mirror, so. <laughs> so I just check myself. I look mildly adequate. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm gonna show you how I go from this. Hey guys, how you doing? It's me back again with another video to this. I am the powerfulest of them all. Um, today I decided I'm going to be doing a get ready with me video, which is something I don't really do because I'm very self-conscious. As you can see, I'm not the prettiest person in the world. <laughs> So I use makeup to cover up all my insecurities. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> anyway, guys, so I decided to make this get ready with me video so I could talk to you guys about what's going on in my life so you guys could generally see like how the heck I do my makeup and how the heck I look so good. Maybe there's probably lots of people who think, oh, Katie, you look like garbage. What are you talking about? But you know what? Let's, let's just get right into it, guys. And just so you guys know, if I act a little bit strange, it's because like currently, um, we took down the curtains and there's no curtains in the windows. Honestly, anyone could probably be snapchatting me right now and telling me that I look absolutely insane. Okay guys, so I've got my makeup bag, which is from Five Below, which you can get, I guess, for probably around five dollars. I don't remember. Yeah, it says contents. Pretty important stuff. Yeah, it is pretty important. Make me look beautiful. <laughs> yeah, so I've got a couple things I'm gonna be using. Uh, these are contacts, like, like circle lenses. It depends if I use them or not. If I feel if I feel good enough about myself that day, I won't wear them to cover up my insecurities. I love my eyes, but you know what? Sometimes it's fun just to use them. Don't judge me. Don't, Don't judge me. me. First thing I usually do is apply this. This is the Hydro Genius uh, for Extra Dry Skin by L'Oreal Paris. I actually suffer from eczema. So my, my skin can get as dry as a desert, my so My dudes. skin also has a lot of acne scarring. The next thing I'm gonna do is, if I can find it, I have this really tiny sample of this Benefit primer. Cause you know I'm poor and I can't really afford nice stuff. So this is the professional pro bomb to minimize the appearance of pores. So this is usually what I put on after I do my moisturizer. I'm not really sure the order, but uh, yeah. So anyway, I've just always been using my hands. You know, I don't really have any- At one time I used the, um, what's it called? The, the beauty blender thing. Everyone has their preferences, but I always like to go in with my hands because, girl, you know what's the easiest to blend with that. Honestly, I'm calling this a get ready with me video, but what the heck am I getting ready for? Honestly, nothing. By the way, guys, I have like a pimple patch on my face. Maybe you guys don't know about that, but I saw them on Faye's video. Hey, it's Faye. Hey, it's Faye. You guys can check her out. She has really cool videos, probably better than mine. Mine are. <laughs> I saw this like pimple patch thing, and I'm like, oh my oh, god, that's, that's so cool. cool. So, like, basically, what it is, it's like this 20 minutes later. It's like a, a blessing. I didn't bring this up because why? Because I probably should bring it up. Um, as you guys know, my last video, well, if you don't know, my last video was about Twice, and, um, they're this K-pop group, I called them Untalented, and a lot of people did not like that. Um, I had gotten threatening messages, I have gotten told to die, I was, um, I was told things about, like, just, just horrible things in general, I was told to go F myself, all this stuff. People say, YouTubers are supposed to have thick skin, but at this point in my life, honestly, I don't have a thick skin and I can't handle, I can't handle it right now. Um, to be honest, when I made that video, I planned on watching twice um, as a person who didn't like them. To be honest, um, my husband, soon to be ex-husband, um, he would always say one of the members was so pretty and so much, like, was so pretty, all this stuff. And eventually I just began to feel like bitter towards them. Um, over time, I began to realize, hey, this isn't this isn't necessary. Why do I feel so bitter? You know, like I shouldn't feel so bitter towards this group. They did nothing to me. I've never actually disliked a group. When I realized I was I didn't like Twice, it wasn't really for a legitimate reason. I think I was honestly over jealous of them. Like I said in my video, which I really was, because my husband always would, always would call that Zoo You girl so much more pretty and stuff. 
I don't know. I just got really upset and I, I, I don't know. I decided to make that video and open my heart and try to like, try to be as positive as I could towards them. At the beginning of the video, I was like, oh, they're untalented, they can't sing. But actually recently guys, I've seen um, newer MR removed videos and they, they're really trying and I apologize for calling them untalented. <laughs> I even, there were times where I would try to learn uh, twice dances from my ex too because I thought he'd like it, all this stuff. Ah, hey, stop! I, why? I just don't get it. I don't even know how I look right now, honestly. I don't have a mirror, so. <laughs> so I just checked myself. I look mildly adequate. <laughs> we're good enough. I guess my foundation is mildly adequate, even though I look like a ghost at this point. That is my goal. No, no, just kidding. I'm losing things, guys. I don't know what I'm doing. I swear to God, people are watching me out my window. I feel so paranoid. Do I use concealer with this? I don't know. This is... Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. Holy crap. This is the Dermacol Film Studio makeup cover. Um, I have really bad acne scarring, and my skin is really red, so I really want something with lots of coverage. I saw this after... I think I googled it. Best coverage. And I saw, I think, Nikki Tutorials. She had it and it lurked really good with concealer and it didn't need a lot of, uh, a lot of, uh, you know, product. So I was like, oh, this is perfect because I don't have a lot of money to spend for this. <laughs> so I just, I just was like, okay, this is perfect. Let me just try this out. Okay, so, but and then this is the Brightening Creamy Concealer by Ma Maybelline in, um, 10, which I think is, what is it called? Fair? Yeah, fair, shade 10. No, I think it- oh my god, I just heard someone at the door, but it's just, uh, the wind. I'm so anxious right now. I'm going crazy, guys. And then I- I like to just highlight right here, and then I guess sometimes my nose, because... Why not? I don't even know what I'm doing hardly anymore. It's gonna look like poop when I'm done, most likely. Um... Yeah. Okay, so then I'm gonna go in with this. This is my uh, pe peri, peri cutter, cutter. Uh, it's like a mini fridge, and it came with like lip tints, and it came with uh, lip tints as well as these little uh, concealer and uh, cheek things, which I thought was really cool because I don't like using a lot of stuff, but I over time I've gradually been using more and more because my self confidence has dwindled so much. I'm gonna use the contour shade, which is like this, it's called Ink Velvet, it's like a brown color. How did I lose 35 pounds? Well guys, I just, I don't, I don't really know. After I had the baby, after I had Lily, I was, I was, um, what was I? I think I was like 136 or something like that. I was like about 136 pounds. Um, before I had the baby, I was like 108 pounds. Um, my self-confidence dropped. And I felt really ugly when I would look at myself. Sometimes I'd cry about it because being a person who's anorexic in the past, like, and then all, you know, like all of a sudden, you know, weighing that much again, the most I ever weighed in my life was like 140 pounds, which I know is not that. But in my mind, I had, I didn't exercise at all. All the time, I, like before I had Lily and I was, I was 140 pounds. Only thing I did really was just play video games all day. <laughs> so yeah, I was like, you know, of course I would be, you know, chubby. A lot of people I know that are 140 pounds, they look stinking amazing. Um, but me, I was just lazy. <laughs> so. I was obviously very self-conscious in uh, high school. Uh, I lost, I lost it all, but it was in a very unhealthy way that I'm not proud of. So this time when I went to lose weight, I didn't do it in any unhealthy way. What I did really was, it took a year. I just 
ate healthy. Um, my husband was Korean and um, I would eat Korean food with him. I ate a lot of soups. I didn't really eat that much unhealthy food per se. So, and then I exercise a lot too. I would dance even though I suck at dancing. That's gonna look horrible probably. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. My nose is gonna look crooked, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, I would dance a lot even though I suck at dancing. And if I'm extra honest with you guys, if I'm really honest with you guys, after I left, after I left my husband, I, I didn't realize it, but I, I didn't eat that much. Um, because I was very depressed. I lost two pounds, but that was really not, <laughs> that wasn't really the main thing. I think the mo most, I don't even know if this is even going to be helpful, but I think like the best thing for people to do really is just to exercise, monitor what you eat, not like, you know, not like cut out things, but just be balanced, really. Eat less, I guess, but not extremely less. Just be wise with what you're eating. Don't eat like a crap ton of stuff. Don't binge. Don't do all that stuff. Just exercise. Like I did K-pop dancing a lot of the time. That's basically all I did. But sometimes I would do, you know, workout videos and that kind of stuff. Like all on YouTube because- I, I can't afford to go to the gym. You can do that. I can't afford that. After I had Lily, I was very busy a lot of the time. I didn't, I didn't exercise very much. But I, I did when she was asleep. So even though it took a while, I thought after I had baby Lily, I felt ugly, unattractive, and I was so sad because I felt like everything was so hard because as a new mom, not even my age, just as a new, new mom, I was very overwhelmed by new body afterward and everything. Um, so it was pretty hard. Um, eventually I became okay with it. And I just thought, you know what, it doesn't matter. I'll just exercise and I'll just keep trying my best and we'll see how it goes. And eventually I got back to uh, the way I was before. All things are possible, guys. You just can't, you can't give up. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I didn't even put uh, eyeshadow or anything on. I just put eyeliner on. Wow, Katie, you're so smart. And that's really all. Um. I honestly, my eyeliner is so uneven, but that is all good, friends. That is all good because, you know what? My life is also uneven. Ah, wow, Katie, you're so tacky. No. Okay. That's, that's decent enough. That's decent enough. I feel like everyone, honestly, who is like anything, anything to do with like, you know, any good at makeup is probably cringing right now. At my eyes! what I'm doing and that's fine because you know what I don't know anything about makeup and to you I apologize <laughs> all right so then I put my mascara on because I need some sort of eyelashes I mean, another thing that's uh, going on in my life I'm going into a custody battle with uh, for my daughter which is really upsetting to me because I I think what I'm doing is best for my daughter, but other people do not think so. And I'm very, 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 very upset about it. And I tried to look at the bright side of things. I tried to, I really did try to see him as this really good person. And I always thought, oh, if I just keep, if I just keep waiting, he'll change. He'll change. I thought, he'll change just like he said he would. He definitely will change. He promised me before I married him that he's not gonna get angry anymore. He, he promised me. But... It didn't change. So, in the end, I did what was best for my daughter. I don't look that bad, that's good. I don't- I look mildly adequate right now, woohoo, yay! I'm gonna put this highlight wet and wild because I have no money and this is decent enough. And I put these in my inner eye corners because I need some sort of light to my eyes. Also typically I do like the inner eye corners, like the inner corners of my eyes. I don't know why, because I feel like it brings back some sort of like, I don't even know what to call it, definition or something. It'll be fine, blend it out. Anyway guys, I like to do that, and then sometimes I'll put stuff on top as well. 
Oh my god, what is it like? Oh my god, oh my god. I'm like having an anxiety attack over my makeup right now. This is gonna be ugly as heck, guys. Why am I kidding? That's good enough. That's 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 decent enough. What do you guys think? It's it's not horrible. That's not horrible. Okay. I'm gonna put this like middle one like, right here. Shiny, shiny one. What? If I want to be, you know, Katie, KT, if I want to do that, I can just put my hair up because in my videos, I don't ever. So anyway, guys, um, I'm, I just want to say again, I'm sorry for calling twice on Talented. That was really uncalled for. And I just like to say, um, this is my final makeup look. And that's how I go from zero to absolute freaking hero. I'm just, I'm just kidding guys. I hope that um, everything works out for you guys as well as everyone in your lives that you love. Anyway guys, thank you guys for whoever watches this. I love you guys, I love you all. And um, I hope you guys have a nice day or night. See you later peeps. Jonghyun is my favorite, she's my bias. I don't like twice, but yes, I still have a bias. Why is that? I don't know. Um, I know the members' names. Yeah. Anyway, I don't really hate them. They got 10 out of 10 hair, their hair all looked amazing. The contacts, the contacts creeped me out a little bit. I didn't really like the contacts all that much. I think that was cool, but after a little bit I was like, mm, kind of put off by it. I mean, okay, if you're if you're sponsored by a contact brand, but honestly, I don't think it was contacts. I think it was special effects, pretty much. But yeah, um, one of the members, uh, I was like, oh, she just, I, I don't know. She didn't even look like she's Korean anymore with the contacts. I was like, what the heck? Um, but yeah, the song is good, I guess. Um, yeah. song is good. They're all pretty, which I hate and je jealous about. Um, yeah, I don't know what to say. My cat says meow. She's writing this... My cat's writing it 10 meows out of meow. Um, she's staring at me right now. I gotta go get her. Anyway, guys. See ya. I'll see you in my next video. I guess this is supposed to be a Halloween themed video. I don't really know. I don't really know what I'm saying about this. I... Okay, it's down. Spice is not that bad. I just, I'm jealous of them. All right guys, have a good night. See you in my next video. <laughs>